Working with Lumira is really easy. You have access to a whole variety of different type of sources, Excel, text. You can go to any database that uh, supports SQL code, which is, uh, I think, all of them. In memory systems, you can connect to the universe uh, for governed data. You just uh, pick up data. Very important is that you can access uh, all these sources as many times as you wish and combine them. So typical use cases that I pick up data from uh, the universe in my corporate data, data warehouse, combine that with an Excel sheet or um, some data coming from a CRM system that is not connected. I've done that for a little bit of financial data, which I will open up right now. As you can see, all my measures are on my top left hand side. I can create my own measures and add calculations if I wish and change the aggregation types. And over here are all the attributes available in my data set. Very important, I can create hierarchies very easily myself to do drill down. The next step is that I tick the visual, uh, visualize button to create my first analysis. In Lumira, I simply choose the, uh, the type of bar of, uh, or graph that I want. For example, bar or stack bars. I have line and areas. I have different uh, pie donuts. I can plot data on a map if I have geographical data, scatters and bubbles. Very important, a heat map if you want to do a wide spot analysis and a tree map. I can make list overviews. Number point for key performance indicators and over here is a little bit of others. Um, by simply selecting uh, a type of graph, taking two, uh, one or two or various measures and uh, take one of the dimensions. And here's my first graph. I can uh, simply change it, turn it around and say, well, I want to have a step bar one. Uh, I can change the colors very easily by uh, changing the color schemes. And if I want to select a certain area that is of interest, imagine that I want to have a closer look at these two ones. I just select them, exclude or filter them, for example. Now the filters are building up over here, meaning that I now can uh, take this one away and, for example, have a look at uh, this data per month and change my graph again. And this is uh, how easy it is to analyze with Lumira. The uh, visualizations uh, build up. Over here is an example of some data that I plotted on a map. And the next step, if you have a number of visualizations, and I have a whole uh, prepared a number of them over here, what you do is you tick the Compose section. I'm now on the canvas of my Compose section for creating my dashboards. All the visualizations, and I prepared a few are available on my left hand side and I just drag and drop them onto the canvas to create my first dashboard. I uh, will add a few. And very important, I can add text, pictures, uh, and very useful, I can put in input controls, meaning that any attribute available in my data set can be used as interactive filter. So let me just quick, quickly drag and drop one to the canvas. And over here in two minutes, I have my first little dashboard. So if I go to preview mode, this is my dashboard. I can hover the data. I can select it and say, well, I want to filter it and watch the radar chart. If I now filter this section, you will see that the filter applies to all the other graphs on my canvas too. I can um, open the interactive boxes and, uh, for example, choose two countries. And you will see that all the graphs are adjusted automatically to this is interactive self-service business intelligence i prepared a little dashboard for you which took me around 45 minutes just to show you how quickly you can create um, a nice dashboard over here you see that dashboard and let me put it in preview mode for you the dashboards are multi-page capable, so I can create as many pages as I want. I can put in navigation, for example, here's an example. If I take the prediction section, it just skips to the uh, prediction page that I created. Here it is. Every chart I can uh, either click it and select or export the data, aggregated or detailed to CSV or XLS. And again, like already shown, I can open up every single chart and uh, do a deep dive analysis. For example, I could uh, create a web. 
by clicking the wanking button and say well I want to have the top three over here and uh, this is how easy that uh, is being done if I like what I have I can uh, of course the last step share my information sharing can be done in various ways I can uh, export as PDF uh, and as Excel of course but way more important I can publish my uh, information to for example the BR platform and so it's accessible to uh, all the users that have access to that platform or are authorized. Thank you for your attention.